Let's see, what can we get into today? Aha, big track. So here she is, the 1979 Milton Bradley Big Track. You know, this is one of those things that if you were a kid around the time of 79, you either wanted this thing or you had it. It was fairly expensive at the time, so I never did have one. Uh, finally, finally got that solved. What we're going to do here, we're going to do a quick few once-overs here. Then we're going to get into it. It does have a what's called a transport, which is kind of like a dump truck that it attachment that it tows. I do have that, but we're not really going to get into that on this because I find it kind of boring. This is going to be mainly about the unit itself. So here's a few shots of it, and then we're going to delve into uh, playing around with it a little bit. Being that this is programmable, Here's your keypad. The way this works, it's a little difficult at first, but you get the hang of it pretty quick. First thing you want to do is hit clear. You got to clear out all the former. It, it can only hold one pattern of set commands per time. And you hit, as soon as you turn it off and turn it back on, if you hit the test button, it'll run a quick little test pattern. You want to hit clear to get rid of that test pattern. This is the test. That's it. Now it should come back. Okay. So that was the test pattern. Okay, then firing is just hit the, uh, there we go, the red fire button, and then how many times you want it to fire. So we hit fire five, it's gonna fire five times. When you're all finished with your commands, you hit go and it will run what you just typed in. Now let's do a little quick program of our own. So let's say we want it to go, first we wanna hit clear, then we want it to go forward. Let's say three lengths, then we want it to fire nine times, then we want it to go back three lengths right to us and we hit go and that's how she works